If a test is given to enough people, a particular pattern will emerge. Most people will earn scores on or close to the average or mean, with fewer earning scores at either of the extremes above or below the mean. This resulting shape is called the bell curve. Standardized tests generate standard scores, which compare a test taker's performance to those of same age peers. Standard scores indicate where a test taker would be under the bell curve. There are several types of standard scores. With percentile scores or ranks, 50 is average. Many standard scores have a mean of 100, such as intelligence or IQ scores. Achievement batteries often use these kind of scores. Subtest or scaled scores range from 1 to 19, with 10 being the mean. For T scores, 50 represents average performance. A standard deviation is a set distance from the mean. One standard deviation below the mean to one standard deviation above defines the average range. Most test takers will score in this big area under the bell curve. These scores define the lower edge of the average range, and these scores define the upper edge. Again, most test takers will earn scores in this big area under the bell curve. The average range for percentile scores is between the 16th and 84th. The average range for standard scores is between 85 and 115. The average range for subtest or scale scores is between 7 and 13. And the average range for T-scores is between 40 and 60. These and lower scores are uncommonly weak. Few test takers will earn these scores. These and higher scores are uncommonly strong. Few test takers will earn these scores.